Today's Wednesday. It's quarter to eight in the morning. I just woke up. Green salad up, a green salad down. Um, I got a train in about an hour to go into town because I'm getting a haircut today. The appointment isn't till 10, but I want to get some breakfast at McDonald's because I've never had. And I'm sure it's good and I want to try it. So no breakfast for me here this morning, only at McDonald's. <laughs> trains in eight minutes I might still make it let's go I made it I made it early and I had to run back because I forgot something this uh, voucher I have for 10 francs off my next train journey so instead of costing me 10 francs it only cost me 80 cents woohoo and now we wait for the train onto the train and I got the ticket for only 80 cents. Good news. I'm gonna go to McDonald's now and get some breakfast. I'm excited, I've never been to McDonald's for breakfast. I hope it's not too overrated. There's no poster for breakfast. I hope they still do breakfast. Hot breakfast. Bacon and egg McMuffin. And orange juice. And they also have pancakes, which I wasn't aware of. Let's see what this looks like. Mmm, yeah. Ooh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Mmm. Mmm. It was okay. Um, not as filling as I expected, and also it didn't taste incredible. I mean, it tasted okay, but not worth waking up this early for. However, they do have pancakes, and I'm still hungry, so I think I'll get some pancakes. Two ninety for three pancakes, which is pretty good if you compare that to where is it? Five ten for a bacon and egg McMuffin, which is probably less filling, and fake maple syrup. As a Canadian, I can assure you that is not maple syrup, but it tastes fine. Let's see what the pancakes are like. They are a much better deal than the McMuffin, in my opinion. They taste a lot better, and they're a lot more filling, and they're cheaper. So what more can you ask? Honestly, I'm impressed. They're a lot better than I expected. Except for that maple syrup. That's fake maple syrup, and it tastes weird. But there's also Nutella and butter, so I might just get that next time. Or a jelly jam thing. Really good breakfast. probably can't tell but it's lightly snowing which is awesome because snow's the best yeah I got about a half hour to kill before I got my hairdresser's appointment so I will take part in my favorite thing to do in town trying on Ralph Lauren clothes more specifically seeing if there's any new items from the new collection Valley shoes, Gucci sneakers, rollies that don't tick tock the appointment is in 20 minutes it takes about 10 minutes to get there so I'll make this quick, but I'll probably be back later on, after the appointment, once this looks better. All right, well, either I've bulked up a little, or their slim fits have gotten slimmer, or a bit of both. It fits pretty damn well, and I kind of like the look. I'll think about it. I'm not sure yet. It's on sale. It'll probably still be there later on. I've got to go get that haircut, but they put it aside for me for about an hour, which, you know, by then I'll be back here. Because I like it, but I'm still not sure. I still got to think about it. Also, there's a whole bunch of stuff that I saw from like the new Ralph Lauren collection that I'd seen online, but not in stores, like jackets and stuff. And there's lots more sales because it's like 70% off, 50% off. So I don't know yet. But now, haircut time. Let's go. Here we are. I'm seven minutes early, but that's okay. Here's before. And this is after. Really happy with it. Congrats to this guy, he's awesome. Uh, it's the last time we get to be in this salon. Next time he's moving to another one, so yes. looking forward to that. Are you excited? Yes, we are. Awesome. 
Queen. See you next time. Yeah. <laughs> All right, haircut is done. That was awesome. I'm gonna go back to that store, maybe buy the polo, because I really like it and I like the color and it's like 70% off. So why the hell not? I don't know yet. Let's, uh, let's see. Okay, I bought the polo for a ridiculously low price of 44 francs and 70 cents. Awesome end of season sale. And there's a couple of things I wanna try on now. For the fun of it okay this is one of those things that i saw online and i wanted to try it on and i would never buy it probably um but i just really like the look actually look at that it's a white you probably can't tell but it's a white sweater see with the, the u.s flag embroidered on there and i think it's pretty cool and it fits well um it fits really well actually but you know i'm not gonna wear a white sweater because it gets insanely dirty but i really like it Next up in things I would never buy because I wouldn't get enough wear out of them, but I still wanted to try on, this jacket. Uh, it's like a black varsity kind of thing, boxing, which I think is really cool. And on the back, can you wait? On the back, see that? New York Boxing Club. Pretty cool. Um, let me close it up real quick. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like it a lot. Let's reverse it. The other side is more of a twill side. It's still got... The other side is more of a twill side. Uh, I like it, except it's black, and I'm not a fan of black. Though this is kind of cool, though. I don't know. Um, I like it a lot. But then there's also a navy one that I saw, maybe, on eBay. I don't know. I just want a bomber jacket, because bombers look really, really, really awesome. Okay, here's the polo. Really happy with that. Um, especially because it was so cheap. And that's the thing with those two other things, the sweater and the jacket, as awesome as they are, and as much as I would love to have them, um, they're too expensive for the amount of wear they would get. I wouldn't wear them enough to justify paying that much. The sweater was, I mean, with the sale, it was maybe around like 250 or something. And the jacket was probably, I don't know, maybe like four or 500 or something, which is a little more than I'm willing to put on those kind of things right now. Um, maybe one day. Like I said, the jacket, there's a similar one. There's a blue similar one that I tried on already, but I didn't film. That's on eBay for, I'm not sure how much. And then there's also the Alpha Industries Slim Fit Bomber MA1, which is meant to be really, really good from what I've heard. So that's another option. I think I might go with that. Maybe for my birthday. My birthday's coming up. So we'll see. I'm going to go home because there's nothing else I had to do here in town. Get some lunch, and then I think I'm meeting up with Toby later on to plan the secret projects going down this weekend. Exciting stuff. All right, let's go home. My phone died because of the cold, but I'm back home now. It was a really good morning meeting up with Toby some point later today. I don't know when yet. It's actually easier to meet up with Toby tomorrow, so I'm doing that tomorrow. That's it for today's vlog. If you were entertained, if you enjoyed it, give it a like. Comment if you got something to say. Subscribe if you want to see daily vlogs. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.